Sure, my name is Claire Walker. I have a background in chemistry and civil and environmental engineering. I'm the project manager with Innovative Construction Solutions and we're the contractor doing the Dennett Dam removal. Uh, here we are working on the downstream end of our diversion channel, building our downstream temporary coffer dam to divert water away from the work area. This project is being done for many reasons. The dam has been condemned now for quite a while uh, and a few people have drowned here and it creates an obstruction for salmon swimming upstream on the Tuolumne River. The project is being funded in part by the Tuolumne River Trust and we're working for the city of Modesto. The first thing that we did was build our access road in and set up environmental controls which included BMPs uh, to protect the waterway and environmental site controls including uh, exclusionary fencing around trees to be protected on site um, and maintain existing vegetation as much as possible. We then uh, began installation of an upstream coffer dam which consisted both of a base rock platform and sheet piles driven into the ground. Uh, this upstream coffer dam installation continued while we were installing the upstream coffer dam. In tandem, we worked on the diversion channel to excavate material to an elevation to allow water to flow around our work area. This diversion channel was lined with plastic to reduce turbidity uh, that would be causing any increased turbidity in the river as it flowed through this area. And additionally, we installed um, sandbags to help uh, dissipate water velocity. And that's what you see us currently installing our super sack sandbags at the downstream end of our diversion channel. Uh, we're still preparing this outlet of the diversion channel to slow water down. And uh, we are also installing a downstream coffer dam, which prevents backflow of the water back into our work area. Today, we will begin dewatering our work area to pump water out. We do have an on-site biologist, uh, which will have a net to help retrieve any fish that are still in our work area. Once the work area is dewatered, then we will begin excavation um, of debris and also of the existing Dennett Dam, which consists of sheet pile, uh, timber piles, which are wood, concrete debris, and any other uh, debris that we find associated with the former Dennett Dam. We will then be regrading the riverbed uh, and installing one-ton rock at the bottom of excavation, which will help prevent any future scouring of the riverbed. And uh, following regrading of the area to uh, the natural riverbed elevation contours given on our design drawings, then we will uh, remove our temporary coffer dams Following removal of our temporary coffer dams, the river will once again flow through the uh, natural Tuolumne River, and then we will restore the diversion channel back to pre-existing conditions. And we will complete uh, with restoration of the area, including hydro seeding to help uh, promote regrowth of any vegetation that we needed to remove during our work.